we bout to play 2K Brutal Sim, step back J Kobe got that clutch, throw it up, that's game I'm going through the lane, Russell Westbrook quickness Kyrie What up, what up, it's your boy You don't know Brutal Sim on the scene with him me with a neck to tour of y'all I'm bringing one of the most successful, the most dangerous, the most lethal, the most unstoppable play in basketball history, the pick and roll, man. This has been requested, and I do apologize. I should have brought this tutorial a minute ago because I abused this. I look, yo, I abused the pick and roll and time I'm playing online head to head, domination, my career, whatever it is. I do abuse it, man. So I hope these tips will help you all out. So let's start off by the control configuration, man. You gotta press and hold L1 to call for the pick and roll. While holding L1, to roll or fade, you gotta tap R1. To select size, you gotta tap R2. Or to slip or fade before the pick hits, you gotta tap L1 again, all right? Very simple controllers. I'm not getting too complicated in this tutorial, man, all right? Make it as simple as possible, all right? Now, when setting and calling for a pick and roll, man, first thing you gotta look, do is look at your personnel. You gotta know the strengths and your weakness. Now, here I'm using Kyrie, man, and look at the defender he drops back. Now, Kyrie is one of the best point guard shooters in the league. So, once I pick this wide open, cash. Alright, very simple, very simple, man. Just identifying the strengths and the weakness. Now in this play, I'm using Russell Westbrook, man. As you notice, the defender jumps the pick, all right, which leaves the open lane for one of the best slashers to the league to take advantage of, man, all right? So you gotta know your personnel. Westbrook is extremely quick, great first step. So of course I'm taking to the rim if it's there. Now this time around, I'm using Chris Bosh. And you notice I switch it to fade because he's a great shooter, great step back shooter in the mid range to three point range man all right and i'm going to show you a next ex example with kevin durant where i switch it to fade very good mid range to three cash very simple very effective now i'm running it here with westbrook again and as you see in the background no one's playing help defense so all i do is hit that slip straight to the rim for the easy bucket very simple man now this is my secret weapon right here. No one does it, making the extra pass on the pick and roll. Once you make the extra pass, look at it right here, man. I took the pick, one pass, and guess what? Bosh open on the baseline for the easy layup, man. This is always gonna be available. I do it in gauntlet, I do it in domination, I do it in head to head. It's always gonna be available, that extra pass, <laughs> yo. You have no idea, man. Just call that pick. You might have to do a little extra dribble like you're gonna see on this clip right here, man. Check it out. One dribble, look, wide open, easy layup, man. Very simple. Because any computer does some, most of the time they're gonna drop, and people let you play, let computer play defense a lot, man. And computer does a great job at covering up. All right, but that extra pass it makes it very difficult for them to recover, man. All right, so these are my tips. Remember these extra passes right here, very effective. You should use this one. This one right here is the secret weapon. <laughs> all right, I hope this video help you all out. We're running this pick and roll, man. Y'all could go back check out the controllers, practice it a lot. Y'all should probably get in my career or play. Um, just go and play now and test these out or domination or wherever, man. I hope this helped you all out. If you're first time to my channel, like the video, share the video, hit your boy subscribe. If it's not your first time, like the video, share the video, you never know who it's gonna help. It's your boy, you don't know. Brutal Simonisi, we can I mean. One love, respect, bless.